everyone. Today I'm going to be showing you how to custom create for DTF iron on labels for back to school. This is used for school clothing, sports tights, umbrellas and school bags. It's made easy to transfer with heat press or iron at 150 degrees for 20 seconds. We're going to select do-it-yourself prints and custom DTF. It will open up all of your information on the left hand side for application once you have your DTF items. We're going to select direct to film full color prints 570 millimeters by 300 millimeters. Please note our allowed extensions are PNG, PDF, AI, EPS, PSD, TIFF, CDR and SVG. Please also, once you, if you're uploading, your artwork needs to have a transparent background and all your text or fonts must be converted to curves. So if we go straight and we're going to upload, you can always add your spaceship and simply add to cart. If you don't have preset artwork, you can go and start designing using our online designer tool. It will then open up your design area. On the left hand side we've got text, art, you can upload and add a name and number. So if we select art, we've got a whole bunch of different preset artworks for you to use. We're going to select shapes and let's go and select our square. Please note on the left and the bottom it shows you the different sizing so you can get your labels correct for the items you are or for your clothing items. So over here, we're going to add text. And simply resize to our square. You can always change the color, the font, and add a border. If we go to artwork again, let's say, for example, we're going to choose school. And we can add a little pencil if wanted. You can also then go and add a simple name and number. And that can be straight for your labels as well. And you can also then go and add your number here on the left hand side. Or if you want, you can go and upload. If we're going to import, we simply go upload and let's say for example we're selecting Amanda Williams and there you've got your designs that you've already done placed on our artboard. Please note you can duplicate your art as many times as you want and fill up the whole artboard. Once you've done that, you'll see in the top right hand corner, your price has stayed the same, no matter how small or how big you make your artwork. You always go proceed, add to cart, and you can review your artwork. Once you've done that, you go proceed, And it'll show you everything that you've added to cart. So here is what you've just designed. Over there, you proceed to check out. And it'll bring up all the information you need to fill out for shipping. We thank you very much for listening and we hope to see you back soon. Bye.